Hey guys, it's me, Chris again. This time we're going to make a plug fast test on different brand X58 chipset based motherboards. What the plug fast want to show you guys is the PCI supported capability of different motherboard makers. Actually, the PCI supported capability not only de depends on the PCI slot that the motherboard provides. It is also related to the multiple manufacturer layout design. Okay, here we pick three different brands of X58 motherboard. The first one is SROC X58 supercomputer motherboard. The second one is G brand X58 motherboard. And the last one is M brand X58 motherboard. As you can see on the first SROC X58 supercomputer motherboard, it provides four PCI slots. And on the second one, G brand, it provides three PCI slots. And on the last one, the M brand X58 motherboard, it provides two PCI slots only. As I said before, the PCI slot supported capability not only depends on the PCI slot that the motherboard provides. It is also related to the motherboard maker layout design. So we will make the plot fast to prove this and we will show you later. Okay, on the first SROC X58 supercomputer motherboard, not only provides four PCI slots, we also have a considerate design for users. So you can see here, for the traditional design, the front panel, the firewire, the USB connectors are usually to be put here. But now, that's what I've moved these connectors to here. It's besides a dim slot. What's the benefit of this change? Okay, as you can see here. For the fourth PCI slot, when we install the fourth PCI card here, normally the fourth PCI EVGA card should conflict with the traditional design of the front panel, USB connectors, and um, FireWire connectors. However, with SROC considerate design, the connectors of front panel, FireWire, and USB will not cause any conflict with the PCIe VGA card. Okay, here, here is the first PCIe, PCIe VGA card. We installed it on SROC X58 supercomputer motherboard. And the second one, VGA card. Third one, And the last one, especially the last one, as I mentioned before, with the new design, we can release the space for the fourth PCI slot. Okay, here is the second X58 motherboard from G Brand. So you can see here, they only provide three PCI slots. But the key is, they're still with um, old, with the traditional layout design, as you can see here. But the firewire connectors for the USB connectors, front panel connect connectors, still here. It will cause the conflict with the third PCI slot. It's the first one, BJ card. And the second one. As you can see, for the old traditional design, the firewire connector here, USB connector here, front panel connector here, will occupy the space for the third PCI slot. However, when I'm trying to install the third PCI EVGA card on the third PCI slot, see here. Oh oh. 
it definitely causes the conflict with these connectors. And as you can see here, oops, the golden finger is not installed to the slot properly. So it proves that the, um, the G Brand X58 layout design is a wrong design. Although they provide three PCIe slots, however, the third PCI slot is waste and useless. Okay, the last one is M Brand X58 chipset motherboard. And as we know, the Intel X58 chipset is current high end product from Intel chipset. However, on this main board, we can find that only provides two PCI slots. Actually, it is kind of waste to us to, especially for the X58 chipset, because it is a high-end chipset product. Now, if you are going to buy a new X58 chipset motherboard, I guess you are definitely a um, performance gamer or maybe a um, computer enthusiast. Of course, as we know that with more VJ cards installed on your computer, you definitely get much more performance on your system. So if you want to get the most, the maximum performance on your X58 motherboard, so what is your best choice for the X58 motherboard? Let's rock X58 supercomputer, no doubt.